What is good? It is, uh, you know, the O show. <laughs> it is, uh, that time. It's actually a little earlier than that time. But it's all good. Um, Thursday. The last scheduled O show this week, though, I almost always wind up doing some bonus stream activity over the weekend. Hope you guys had a chill day as usual. I certainly did. Got some writing in, some reading. The weather wasn't too bad. Not really enjoying this humidity, but I'll take it as long as it gets me some cooler weather. Today we're going to get started with uh, continuing a master difficulty stalker Shadow of Chernobyl playthrough with Stalker Complete installed. And it's uh, really scary, man. To be honest, it's fucking scary. Like, I kind of get like an adrenaline rush because of how scary it is. Marked one. Yo, Mission Mai, thanks for following. That does put us a little bit closer to unlocking Chivo number two, so big ups. Haven't really started. You like the stalker intro screen so much. You had to follow the channel. <laughs> uh, Alright, let's load this. Huh. All right. Uh, so I just did the army thing. So I think they might actually be sending some some bad dudes toward the uh, rookie camp. I'm not sure. Uh, but I think it's probably time to just t suck it up, head into the next lab, head to X16. I have a quest to purge this area of mutants, but it's like too obnoxious to complete. Yo, the military. I wonder if they've taken that place back over already yet. <sighs> I have a mission to assassinate a stalker that's like chilling in the bar, which that's going to be kind of tough. Got a mission to kill some bandits at the wild territory. That works because that's kind of on my way anyway. Then here's the lab and Yantar I have to go into. Great. Wonderful. <laughs> and then I have this bloodsucker nest in the army warehouses to clear out. <coughs> Um, Alright, I think my first move is going to need to be to get back to the bar and re-equip. That's probably step one in the life of a stalker here. So I'm just going to need to move north. 
threw the cord in in the garbage. <laughs> Get to the bar, re-equip, then we'll go from there. I think I'm fully out of ammo for my primary, so... It'll be fun. <laughs> Subs De Zeus GPV Guru. <clears throat> Welcome back, Death Watcher. Hope you guys are having a chill Thursday. If not, we'll see what we can do about making it a little more chill for you. <clears throat> but to get things going on the O show, I'm gonna kick back. As much as you can kick back in the zone and uh, put in some work on the stalker playthrough, man. This thing is gonna take forever. <laughs> We're gonna be playing stalker for like months. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining, I just hope you guys enjoy. Pretty hyped that the stream has been live for 14 minutes and people in chat are already talking about Hitler. That's just some of the magic that is Twitch.tv. Why can military takes this thing over like every time? They're like some kind of infection, you know? You like leave them to their own devices just for a moment. They're back. That bloodsucker is uh, hurting you, bro. You shouldn't go over there, those bloodsuckers, man. Did you kill them? You killed them! Nicely done! Yo, that's the first time I've ever seen a stalker successfully fight off a bloodsucker. That was impressive. Wow. <clears throat> Nicely done, sir. I don't want to have to go back through this electrical thing every time, so I, like, try to kill... The military guys, you know? If I can go around like this away. I know they're all mad and stuff, but... Maybe I can slip through there. It'll be all good. Yeah? Like, fine. It's no big deal. <laughs> One thing about Stalker is the fact that uh, you can kind of just run a lot. Most uh, situations where you encounter enemies... Um, uh, mutants, especially... You're almost always better off just to GTFO. Just to run. If you run, a lot of times you'll be okay. <laughs> I'm gonna try to employ that more actually. Like obviously when you're clearing out labs and stuff, you can't have a prerogative to kill everybody. But uh What's this guy's problem? But aside from when you're clearing out like a, a lab when like three snorks, you know, start to hump my leg, I'm just gonna get the fuck out of there. Chug some Red Bull life, I have to, you know? Who are these scumbags? I'm trying to get in your little fight, just do your shit. Bros, you're never gonna hit me. Trust. I wonder where those, uh... Enemy NPCs are coming from. That's like a lot. I thought, uh, this area is relatively clear. 
I love the uh, faction conflict stuff in this game, though. All right, so military is taking this over too. Yo, I'm on your side. Fuck up the military. Oh wait, that's like one military guy out there by his lonesome. Rip. <laughs> Dog death, rip. Puppies. Really now? Yeah, man. Get the puppies. <laughs> Holy fuck. The zone, man. Fully zone grown organic snorks. That is what they are, yeah. Doesn't make me hate them any less. I'm genuinely frightened of uh, going into the lab. The labs are so scary and intense, but I think if you accept that you're going to die a bunch of times, they're like a lot less scary and intense, you know? Kind of embrace death a bit. Traveling through the garbage at night like this also is probably not one of the best stalker decisions I've ever made, but you know. Sometimes a man must be a man. Plus, look at that beautiful sunset, you know? Can't miss that. <laughs> Sebatum thinks I made the military mad when I took out their checkpoint. Could be. Could have tipped them off to be a bit more aggressive. Good observation, my friend. Death Watcher, I would never appreciate a snork. Snork Appreciation Day, more like Snork Awareness Day. Kids, if you see a guy with a gas mask with the end all dangling down, he's not a goth, he's a killer. Now, y'all are going to be upset at me, I think, but I'm probably going to do something pretty cheeky-breaky up here at the bar. There's a, a trick someone on YouTube mentioned that you can do to get a lot of ammo. Because apparently every time you save and reload your game, or basically save, exit the client, and reload the client, the bartender will have... Whoops. Uh, more... His uh, ammo supplies will be... Restocked, so you can, uh, it's a cheeky way to get a bunch of ammo. Medithian, there was a bug where the snork jumping sound was replaced with the get out of here stalker line. Because that, that would, can I put that back in? Like, that would make them a lot less scary if the, every time they leave to me, they're like, Get out of the stalker. <clears throat> oh shit, the new Humble Bundle apparently comes with four copies of Insurgency, according to the Infinite Couch. Um, that's pretty hype. Give me a copy. I want to try it. Oh, nice. They're out, like, helping me this time. That's pretty hip. They never help me with the dogs. It's like... W I'm, like, f fully accepted now.
the bar at night. New experience. Wiki, you know that uh, Devo gets whatever Devo wants. Don't, don't be coy. <clears throat> All right, so let's do. Do I have any missions to turn in? I don't think so. I do not. Okay. So let me buy his full ammo supply here. Do I have anything to sell? I actually don't believe that I do. Alright. And... Yeah, I'll, uh, I've got 244 rounds for my secondary. I think I'm pretty chill out right there, actually. I will buy his nades. All right, cool. So here's supposedly what's supposed to work here. Um, I'm gonna do a manual save over here in this corner. All right. I'm gonna quit the client. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Cheeky breaky. And then uh, relaunch the stalker client. And the barkeep should have more ammo in his inventory. If anyone in chat genuinely needs a way to determine a winner, uh, any moderator can run the exclamation winner command and then Nightbot will sort it out for you. Alright, so let's see if this refreshes the barkeep's uh, stock. It does. It's pretty cheeky breaky. Barkeep, sell me ammo. Oh, it works. 420 rounds, nice. All right, that's pretty cheeky. Um, so honestly, as a convenience thing, I'm gonna do this a couple times here real quick, and um, so that I don't have to buy ammo a thousand times, you know. I'm going to do it at least one more time. Because it's not really cheating. Just getting ammo. Well, I'm just not going to look at chat while this white man... Rap battle goes on. It's gonna hurt me. Look at Chris watching. Aren't you supposed to be fucking working, bro? Hello, JF Kraken. Right now, I'm being very cheeky breaky with the client reload ammo exploitation technique. Alright, almost 700 rounds. Probably good there. Alright. Alright. Oh, yeah. Repairs. Derp.
There we go. Okay. Uh, so like I was saying, I'm not really going to try to assassinate this stalker just yet because they'll make the people here very upset at me. Um, I think the next move is going to be to move through the wild territory back into Yantar. And uh, do this lab, man. Pretty hype. Also terrifying. <laughs> I will try to grab that, uh... Stash, if I can, though. <laughs> what the hell is that TV in the background showing? I didn't, uh, take a look. Let's take a look real quick. Is it the same thing that was on the other TV? Yeah, it's like, uh... Images from a documentary about uh, Chernobyl. I'm sure you can find it on YouTube. That would probably be pretty entertaining to watch, actually. Now I'm going to have to hunt it down. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to travel at night. That's like a fucking fool's errand in this game. Let's do the whole sleep move down here where it's safe. Yo, you're gonna watch me while I sleep right here in this hallway, okay? Can't trust these stalkers, you feel me? Man, do you guys remember that when Tatu was super popular because they were like lesbians? People were like, oh my god. A, a, a mainstream musical act that kisses each other. Though you do have to admit, Tatu's hot as shit. No questioning, no arguments, no, no denials. You know, once you've kind of been out in the shit, you kind of lose respect for all the stalkers that sit around the fire fucking playing guitar and shit all the time. You're like, why aren't you guys out here getting annihilated by 420 snorks? Like some of us. Some bullshit, you know? Like a grave stash. <gasps> Ooh. Is that suit as good as I think it is? Holy free holy. 90, 90, 50, 15 rupture versus 40 rupture, 40 explosion, 20 bullet, 40 fully. So this is like ridiculously as far as good as far as protecting you from the zone conditions. But it's not very good if you actually get shot. I think I'm going to rock it though because fuck it, you know, yellow. The ecologist suit is too badass to pass up. Plus it's got the high quality night vision. I'm gonna wear it. Fuck the monolith suit. Look at that shit. Go sell it real fast. Gonna be heavy as hell to carry around two suits. 
A dude, ecologist suit at the beginning of the run. All right. JF Kraken asks, how the stalkers got so many guitars? I think I agree with Wiki that there's an anomaly that probably just generates guitars, you know? Yep, that is the HEV suit voice. Mm -hmm. Probably part of complete, you are correct, sir. Well, that's pretty hype, man. My little suit right here. Though, I mean, how many dead motherfuckers have we seen in these suits? So. Alright, let's get out into the shit here. At least we have pretty hype night vision. Mullets. Basically thermal vision. I fucking hate this zone that we're headed to right now. The number of uh snorks and bloodsuckers in this area up here is just like it's just it's literally absurd. It's like <laughs> it's literally absurd. Alright, um so we gotta go through here, but we got this task to take out the bandit camp near the bar. Yeah, yeah. The last time I went in here, uh, there was like duty. You know, doing some duty in here. This time, uh, there's going to be like 59 snorks, like literally waiting for me. I'm gonna try not to get scared though. Try to just stay cool. You know, be like, oh, that's a snork, oh dear. Instead of being scared. Duty guys again? Hey. The last time I showed up here, they actually did all my quests for me. I had a quest to kill a certain stalker, and they killed him. And then I had a quest to uh, take out some bandits and they killed them. So maybe that'll be a repeat this time. Be sick if you guys all rolled with me, you know?
Uh, now you're in encouraged. It's fine. That's fine. I'm not gonna blame you, man. Yashka Electrician is your name. Pretty hype name. You guys are tough. Do it. Don't be scared, guys. I'm here, okay? You don't have to be scared if I'm here, alright? Oh, is it like snorks or something out there now? You guys can come forward now. I took I killed him. I killed the scary guy. He's gone. Maybe there's only so far they'll even go out. What's up, bud? What do we got? Alright. The bandit camp is up around here. Yep. Don't nade. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> I was like, I know he's gonna nade me. I don't think the uh, ecological suit does like uh, automatic health or anything like that though. I think it's only for like rads. Dick. There's a bloodsucker right there. There, there we go. What we got over here? Another one? Or is that a snork baby? We got a snork baby right there. <sighs> Why? Every time, you know? Well, we gotta go kill these fucking bandits over here. Despite the fucking snork welcoming party. I was hoping I could just nade these dudes or something like that. Intense battle right here. Can I instew it? Ah, oh, I did it, yay. I'm the best. Best stalker. Ukraine. You guys are using good guns. I'm glad I killed you pretty quick. I think that too. Them Enfields could have hurt me. Grab a sip of my beverage here. Fuck man, there's like no safe places in this game.
You're never safe in the zone. I'm gonna try to get better at trying knife strats on uh, mutants that melee me though. Though honestly the like, the juke and the shoot can kind of work too. Just not ultra reliably. The thing I hate is when they get up behind me silently. That's annoying. And by annoying I mean terrifying. Like this guy right here, doing a little move. Now they're mad. Now they're gonna try and kill me. Fucking rude, dude. But I shot you in the head, you see. You see? I saw you in the nugget. You should, you should be dead. But you're not dead. Take all those bullets to the face to kill, you know? That's what I don't like about you guys. You don't play it fair. <laughs> Maybe if I give the bloodsuckers a stern talking to, they'll be nicer to me, right? What are you scumbags doing here? He didn't even notice me shoot at him. He was like, yeah, whatever. Alright, it says there's a fucking stash over here. Some kind of hellish shit. Uh, it's going to be completely inside of here. Alright. Uh, I'm kind of like partially addicted and partially completely over the ad constant adrenaline rush that is playing stalker. On the one hand that's kind of nice because you're just like ah the whole time. But on the other hand it's like dude I'm so scared right now. <laughs> Like, I think it's telling that playing some Isaac is going to be, like, a chill kind of departure. But they did an amazing job in this game with the atmosphere and uh, that type of shit. For real right now, bro? You guys need a hobby. That isn't shooting at me. Yeah, man. What the fuck? How's the brother supposed to get up in here, though? Is the window not meant to be? Some cock tea shit. That window. Not very cool. Sit there and work hard to try to get in there. And that's how you repay me, game? Fucking scum. Well, how? what's the magical method y'all want me to use to get in here, then? GSC games. It's clearly very important to put a fucking stash inside of there.
Don't make me use this janky physics engine to get in here. That's just like torture, bro. Where's this little nug shooting me from? That can't be him way over there. That'd be crazy. It would be hype is if mutants would aggro on these guys too. You know, they're being racist against me. Holy banditos out here, bro. This is insane. I forgot the number of NPCs the game throws at you on Master. I should have gone ahead and got like a thousand rounds when I was doing that safe scum trick. There's no shame in that with this number of guys being thrown at you. Wowzers. Alright. We done for a moment? I'm just trying to figure out how to get this janky ass stash they put in here. That's literally it, bro. Holy shit, the first time a, a mutant aggroed on a bandit. Then he de-aggroed, but at least he momentarily aggroed, you feel me? I'm very proud of that situation. Alright. What the fuck? That window is fully how you're supposed to get in there. Alright, let's go hump that son of a bitch until we can get in there and get that stash. That's crazy. Don't do that to the player, guys. That's rude. Alright, so I reckon you real talk do have to scoot over a crate and then try to get in there that way. Uh-oh. They all blowed up. Days a barrel, maybe. Whoa. And then we got the cavalry now. Yo, I might just have to say fuck this stash if I don't have a way to get in. I want it. I'm trying to do the good thing and do the content you put in the game, guys. Let me do the content. I'm even being clever and shit. Don't punish me. Oh, man. All right. We're punished out of that one. Well, that sucks. I do get annoyed at very poor design decisions like that, but it's a seven-year-old game made by a Ukrainian company, so what do you expect? <laughs> Uh, maybe how it works is when you come back into the zone each time, those crates are respawned to give you an additional opportunity to actually get a hold of that stash or something. I don't know. Uh, but I do know that I actually care about getting it because, like, this suit that I'm wearing came from a stash, so they're no joke good items. That's just a real pissant way to make the player go get it. Don't punish me, Devo concern, confirm for worse dominatrix, says Wiki. Truth. Truth. I don't like when game designers punish players. I think it's a... If you want people to buy your game, don't punish them. It's pretty simple. You get punished a lot of times in video games for being too intelligent. Usually that's the big punishment. If you're, if you're too clever, you will be punished in the game, but... That's just punishing you by making you have to hump a tiny hole in the wall to be able to get into what should be just like a quick like, oh, there's a stash, and then you walk by, you know? Little slap on the wrist for GSC.
Wait, you get on the roof? Nah, see. If people talk shit in chat, I, I bring you to task. So if this is if this is how it is, let's go back and let's make damn sure, guys, because I don't want anyone to miss out on this stash, especially if we have some folks extremely confident about how to get into it. All right. So let's see. Let's take a look. See here. Take a look at Reinsky. So it appears to me this is how you get to the stash, is right here. There were some crates here, but they got exploded in the fight. So now there doesn't appear to be a way. I tried to use this. Someone said you get on the roof. Let's see if you're right. I've parkour all day. Holy shit. You were correct. Maybe. <laughs> Dude. I think that's supposed to kill you, but I have a badass suit, so it didn't. But you were correct, you do have to get on the roof. I like when people are right, and when they're not just talking shit. Thanks, Nanty. That was ridiculous there, though. There we go. Gonna hump a little, you can get out. Where's the stash? The Is it literally not even in here? I'm like all over the location on the map. Ah, uh, you gotta go no? Is it on the roof itself, perhaps? I wonder if you could even get out through here. Like if it's even a place the stalker can fit through. This is a hell of a spot. It's a trap. Oh, I fit. Yeah, finally, dude. Aha, uh -huh, so it's like on the roof under like an eave. That's usually where they hide shit. It's like up here. Yeah. Alright, that's actually uh... Artifact all equipped. Nice! Big ups to Nancy. Talked the shit, but then delivered and actually knew where the uh, item we were looking for was, so thanks, man. And never mind shit talking as long as it delivers at the end. Put myself in the punishment hole, says Wiki. That's a good name for that place, the punishment hole. I like it. I do think I might want to climb up here and see if I can't recover a bit of ammo from these bodies.
before there's a bloodsucker convention up here. Wait a minute, what? Um, okay. Cares about the Hydro Shock rounds. I actually have too much ammo right now. What's the artifact? It says I picked up a flash, but I didn't. Like, the game thinks I picked up a flash. <laughs> but I did not. But if it's gonna give me credit for picking up a flash, I'm not gonna complain. Like, shit. I'm just, like, did this guy have a flash on him or something? Uh? I don't know. Side seat street at the construction site. Hmm. Might be worth to uh, grab a couple more sashes here before I move on. The main destination here is, of course, the lab. We may not want to dally too much. In fact, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and move on for now. Nante says, Hydra Shock rounds are amazing, though. I'm sure they're quite good. Um, I just don't really use my secondary too much. It's the 45 cal Desert Eagle variant. Nanty says, I'm, I should be glad that Dave isn't playing Stalker like I do. Hoarding everything at the vendors. Honestly, that's how I play in uh, RPGs a lot of the time. It's kind of surprising that I'm not playing that way right now. I tend to be a hoarder usually in most games I play. In Stalker, it's like if you if you hoard too much, you're gonna like never get through the game. Though, so <laughs> gotta kind of hoard intelligently, you know. As long as you uh, have enough rubles going to cover your ammo and repair costs, you don't really need to worry about. Hoarding stuff, to be honest. And then if you do come across something that you need money for, you can just do some runs until you have the rubles. Medithian says the Elder Scrolls games are the worst for hoarding. True tales, man. True tales. Um, alright man, we're gonna head to the entrance of the lab and fucking scare the piss out of ourselves. Let's do it. Ooh, that is true that Hydra Shock probably would tear up mutants quite well. That is true.
What's good, everybody? Children on the Infinite Couch. It is the O Show Thursday. It's the last scheduled O Show of the week. So I almost always wind up doing a bonus stream over the weekend. If you're new to the channel, there's all the usual rigmarole below the video. Uh, but you might learn something if you check it out. And if you're on mobile, you know, I hope you're like chilling in the hot tub. Oh, we got a snork baby already. Are they aggroed? Yep, they're aggroed. Alright, let's test the knife strats on snork, shall we? Do you want to fight or no? Yeah, yeah, come on. Oh, fucking zombie at the same time. No thanks. I want to try knife on snork and see how that does. If I can make it happen. Snork baby, come here. Snork baby. Where are you going? I want to try to knife fight you, bro. Don't, like, sneak up on me. That's cowardly. Here you go. Here you go. Come on. Double. All right, let's go. All right, so two knives took out a snorky. Ooh, but they're gonna hurt me a lot too, obviously. Yo, I'll knife snorks if I want to. <laughs> Knifing mutants is a pretty viable strat most of the time, honestly. They're already in your face, so you just give them a little of that. I hear you gas masking, where you at? Uh, you play a soccer mod where snorks usually one-shot you? Yeah. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm playing on Master, but I don't have anything that makes it any harder than that. It's just Master difficulty. And to be real, I haven't played this game in like seven years, so I don't really remember everything. Um, but I do, I mean, with Bloodsuckers, for instance, they run up and stand directly in front of you still. So you just, and usually one or two knives to the face and they're done. Yo, Snorks and Bloodsuckers are like the only mutants you fight. I guess you could get those Levitator dudes. Pretty good. I don't even remember how to get in here. <laughs> Is it around the other side? Am I going to have to parkour up in here? There you are. You little nuggets. I don't understand his little kick move he does. I can't really get the knife in. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know that knife v snork is very viable, to be real. Um, I'm gonna try with... Do 
these rounds and like if I shoot them right in the head up close if that'll get them. They're like RNG kind of though, so. Oh, here they are. Come in, come in. Alright. Oh, you missed. <laughs> oh, that mid air though. Yeah, this will. I mean, this is viable as long as you fucking kite them. I'm just gonna run out of ammo by the end of this, I'm sure, again. Oh, here we go. He didn't right around here, but. Oh, that looked like a hole in the fence. My cheekies, my brickies. Nancy, yeah, now that you mentioned that the hollow points are so good against mutants, I'm thinking about, uh, next time I'm at a shop, running some of those Hydroshock in my secondary. Seeing how it runs. You've given me two good tips. Don't you feel good about yourself, man? Where would I be without you, you know? Rip. They were all fighting over those grenade rounds. I know it. Wiki says, I now own a game called Euro Truck Simulator. I'm not sure how to feel about this. It should feel great. You should uh, have a couple beverages and do some legal inebriated vehicle operation, dude. You know what does actually work on snorks though is headshots, which is surprising. I would figure that their brain would be so fucked up, you know, the headshots would be like a little kiss to them or something. But uh, no. Headshots will get them. Wait, is that just a head in the corner? Wow. Rough area, man. Rough area. <laughs> I heard a snork aggro, I thought. You like trying to jump up here and he can or something? I hear him. Little snorky, where you at, baby? There's them zombies I hear. Sounds are weird in the soccer verse. Ah, oh, there he is. He <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Killing snorks brings me some fucking glee, man. I uh, I'm not gonna deny that fact whatsoever. Killing snorks is is lovely. Oh, <laughs> where'd you go? Come on. 
Where are you going? You can jump up. Where are you going? Snorky Doodle. Don't leave. Don't leave. He coming? He jumping? Come on. Little snorker. Come here. He's mad. He's very upset that he couldn't get up here and play with me. He tried, but he missed. I know he's not just going to give up, though. Where did he go? He's down there. Crawling around like a little sneaker. There we go. Okay. Snorks. Snorkified. They're just. They're just assholes, really. Don't upset the zombies. Don't upset them. Shut the fuck up. Put it out with the zombie shit, guys. Nobody cares. Alright, that's probably not good. Why there gotta be snorks like left and right, y'all? Why is this one just leaving? Rude. Um, how do I want to get into this place? That's the the question of a lifetime, you know. The bad aim were cool. <laughs> the zombies do have adorable little dances. You have to admit, guys. Like, <laughs> I kind of love watching them stumble around with their guns and shit. You have to admit, it's cute. Yo. I don't know who this Michael Para guy is. Maybe are they saying Michael Sarah? That's gotta be it. They're all big Michael Sarah fans, you know? Can we like not do that? Let me in here? Or is this where I gotta go under? Yeah, there we go. Michael Sarah. Zombies and soccer love Michael Sarah. Who knew dude? Who fucking knew? Alright, my guess is that, uh, the... How did you get there? My guess is that the entrance is going to be down here below, if I remember correctly. Oh my god. Zombies protect me. 
Would this game be even more hype if uh, zombies would aggro with snorks, you know, and take them out for you? Guru says zombies able to operate firearms is truly frightening. Dude, I agree. That's one of my favorite parts of this game are the fact that zombies will shoot at you. I'm in the lab. We're in X16, friends. Great job, Mark One. You've actually made it to the lab. It is vital that we study the installation in the lab. Try to deactivate it so we can examine it properly. Listen, the prototype can't protect you from the strong emission forever. I've provided for this. When you get hit by a strong field, the timer will start ticking. As soon as the time runs out, the prototype will stop protecting you. So take care and remember about the timer. Alright, we're gonna do a full save here. And I think we'll take a break. I think that's a perfect opportunity for a break. The Lab X16, oh god. Scale. What's up, dudes? It is the O Show Thursday, November thirteenth. Thursday the thirteenth. <laughs> um, hanging out, continuing the Stalker Shadow of Chernobyl playthrough on Master difficulty with Stalker complete installed. Uh, but let's take a break before we dive into the lab. I personally am gonna stand up, stretch, get some fresh air, move around, get the blood flowing, that type of thing. I recommend you do something similar. We'll be back in just a few.
Yo, what is good? Thank you for your patience. Hopefully, you moved around a little bit. Got your blood flowing. Something like that. Smoke something, maybe. I don't know. But, uh, let's... Without further ado, descend... Into Lab X16, where I will be peeing my pants. And pooping my butt. Nah, see, you just gotta remember it's a video game, and then it's not scary, right? Right? So, I think the night vision on my suit will help a lot here, but I'll try to remember to turn it off intermittently so you guys can see the, uh... The beauty. Yurka spaghetti zombified rip Okay, it's done. Yo, even this night vision doesn't cut it in some areas. You need night vision and a light. <laughs> the spookiness is real. Especially the fact that they fucking flop around. Right there. Oh, look at this guy. There you are. See his little flips, motherfucker. Little flipper. The amount of snorks that are going to be spawning on me is going to be disgusting. I just want to say that ahead of time here. Just want everyone to be aware of that ahead of time. Hope everyone's buttholes are nice and clenched right now. It's been a very butthole clinchy type of Osho the past couple times. <clears throat> Lab of 16 reasons why no one wants to go there, says Death Watcher. Man. You got it. The main reason you gotta kinda like take your time is that you're pretty limited on your ammo, you know? So you don't wanna like use up all your resources and then not have any rounds to fight your way out, you know? There was literally a snork like right here. Was there, am I like, on all the drugs? Like, there he is, yeah. <clears throat> Does Snorks have an item that they drop out of curiosity? I don't even know that they do. <laughs> what 
Whoop. Whoop. There will be a lot of deaths. Go ahead and get comfortable with that fact. I'm going to try to do my best to like... Minimize the amount of shit I use on the snorks, you know? I kind of lucked out that that one like glitched. It's just a test. Alright, it's just a test. That was a test to see. Try this. Like, all right, he's done for good. Okay. Word. Well, that's pretty dope. One way to do it. So that one snork up there was scripted. Ouchie. <laughs> Sebatum says, yes, the zombies have sucky aim, but with the barrel inside the marked one's mouth, it's tough to miss. Truth. Yo, my suit though, it doesn't give a shit about anomalies. That's one nice thing. My suit's like anomalies? Nah. I hear a snork baby. Ooh. Ouch. <laughs> so, Nante. I remember you said earlier that uh, on Misery, Snorks can one-shot you. Looks like they can one-shot you on this, too. Um, just doesn't always happen. Did I kill him or just make him mad? He fucking lives through nades, but a shot to the head, his life's over. Snorks are like selectively badass, huh? Thank you. 
Yo, what's good, Snake? How's it going, man? Hope you're having a chill night, dude. I'm scared as fuck. Uh, but I'm enjoying myself. I'm kind of addicted to the adrenaline rush that I get off, uh... Stalker, I think. Your heart's all pounding and shit. It's like... Kind of like the feeling you get when you play a Counter-Strike, but... More scared. The uh, scripted spawn in dudes, though. Pretty interesting. Ooh, not good. I'm trying to deal with these snorks with like low amounts of ammo. To make life easier for everyone. I was like, those must be scripted snorks, but they're not. They just gotta come up the stairs. Human. Come on, little nugget. Well, poke your head up then. That was a headshot. You guys saw it. Go oh, fuck you guys. Snorks, not even phased. Fucks given, minimal. These storks are co snorks are confusing me right now. Go ahead and kill me, cause I use nades and stuff. I don't want to do all that. What the fuck? All right, maybe I'll turn on my light. That'll help. Come his butt. Come on up the stairs, son. There's a waste of ammo right here. Up the stairs, my lad. <clears throat> up him. Up those stairs. How many rounds do you need, bud? To lay down and take a nap forever. What are you doing? He was like wounded and limping away? Is that behavior that snorks will do? It looked like he was wounded. That's a good enough snork fight. I'm gonna keep it. Uh, it looked like he was wounded and trying to limp away, bruh. I've noticed them do that, and I've noticed them uh, do that rear up thing. That's not that's not anything I've noticed them do before. But that's kind of spooky. The rear up thing, they stand up and they're like, Rah! they kind of give you an opportunity to shoot them in the head. Though they seem to be invincible. Attention.
Yo, I like barely remember this. I hope I'm doing it right. Yeah, this night vision actually sucks ass. I'm probably better off with my flashlight on right now. Oh wait, it's not that one yet, is it? Nah. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> I hope I quick save recently. That dude unloaded two barrels of shotgun into my mouth. Ah, uh, okay. Bro, the Psy emissions. Alright, let's try not to get unloaded on by a zombie with a shotgun this time, shall we? Attention. Critical emissions. Leave the area immediately. Nah, baby, I got a Psy helmet. I'm good to go. Nothing wrong with earning a little cash while you do this, you know? Picking up a couple artifacts, you know? I want to double check. It's not over here, is it? I'll see. Aren't I glad I did that? Did I save my own life? No, it's upstairs. Alright. Just making sure I wasn't remembering wrong, like an old man. Shut her down. you explain what you are going there for? And where did... Where did you get this photo from? If you only knew where I've just been and what I saw. One day you'll finish badly, Strela. Hold on, son. You're going to make it.
Marked one. Wow. Potato Miss Maximus on my aim there. Nante uh, is asking if I have been spoiled on the fact that, spoiler alert, the marked one is Strelok. No, I already knew that. No worries, man. It's tough to avoid spoilers on a uh, seven year old game, you know? No worries. I played through this when it came out, and then I'm replaying it now. Uh, no, no stress. Ah! I even saw that go off, and I still got hit by it. What a dummy. Um, but I don't remember very much of it, so a lot of it is pretty new to me. As you can tell by how I'm playing, I'm not like feigning reactions. I'm just having a great time playing through Stalker Complete though. That shit wasn't out when I played through. I mean, look how great this looks for a seven year old game. Quite impressive. But ah, I died. Alright. So controller time. Um I'm gonna try my knife strat on the controller. It worked pretty well last time. Alright, knife strategy. Hey god, let's chug an energy drink real quick. Alright, we should be good. Where is this little guy? Where is his actual body? Oh, this is gonna. Here we go. Please. There we go. Gotta calm down, I'm like tripping balls right now. Let the tripping nuts wear off here. It should wear off in a minute, right?
Secret tunnel time. Sanagi uh, says it's just flowing so absurdly smooth, David. What did you do? I'm not sure what you're asking. Uh, are you talking about how the stream looks? What type of ammo is that? For the Ventar? You guys seem to be implying there's a weapon around here though. Did I screw myself out of it? Whatever, I like my gun. <laughs> I done it. I hope my mama's going to be proud. God damn it, guys. Can't you leave a brother alone for like five minutes? I mean, police. Deified one two three. Oh man, thank you for following the channel. That does put us just a little bit closer to unlocking Chivo number two. But big ups, man. I appreciate it. That secret tunnel, though. Ah, oh, you little sneaker! Yo, I saw one of those go into your head. Don't shake your head at me. Yo, a snork foot. Alright, so there is an item. Did you see him shaking his head at me posthumously? Little bastard. I feel almost desensitized to snorks now, dude. I don't know. What is my life? Shit. Uh, if you're a stalker player yourself, by the way, once I get into a safer area, I'll bust out my inventory so you can check out my loadout right now. Hey, bud. Do you see him, like, hop out like he was all fucking tough or something? Unbelievable, man. I'm not sure, like, I just jump over that? Is that what I'm supposed to do? You were trying, bro. You were trying. That was some impressively accurate hip fire from this G36 actually. On that little snork baby. It helps if you call them snork babies. They're not as scary. Sebatum says, human bodies as an alternative fuel source. Maybe not bodies, but human dung, perhaps. That sounds pretty fun, right? Hey, 
Hey, hey, hey. Rude, rude. Death Watcher asks, why does it sound like there's a war going on above? That's the zone, man. There's always a war going on in the zone. I wonder if these snorks spawn in, like are scripted. Oh, they're there right now. Okay. <laughs> Grenades officially just piss off snorks. Kick me with your little foot? What's your problem, bro? Grenades officially just upset snorks. You heard it here first. Uh, I guess it got one. I am gonna consider that uh, advice you gave me, Nancy, about using hollow points on uh, unarmored targets. I never really thought about it because, you know, on, it kind of looks like the snorks have armor, but I doubt it counts, you know. I think it's just cosmetic. So that's pretty neat. Really? Why? Why you gotta? Wait, is a pseudo giant? No, 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 don't follow. No, follow. You little dick. Why you gotta do that? Why you gotta put a pseudo giant, you know? Me too exhausted to walk even? Fuck. You're not allowed to put pseudo giants unless you give me an opportunity to exploit their AI and kill them, okay? Based tunnel escape. Somebody's in trouble over there. So the military is, uh, I guess, clearing the area of zombies. That's what you guys heard going on. Hey, Snorky Butt. I thought you had a, a boyfriend over here somewhere, right? I can hear the pseudo giant walking around underground, I think. Is that snorky stalk mode right there? 